I-96 closed down for several hours earlier today in Eaton County because of a pileup involving a semi. Fox 47's Brian Wilk has the story. We're pulled over on the side of the highway. Traffic's backed up for miles and over my shoulder. You can see the police sirens, so they're at the crash right there. According to police, five different semis jackknifed along the highway, causing traffic backups on several stretches. They say there were only minor injuries. People aren't learning year after year. It's the same thing. If you ain't got to drive, don't drive. Isaac Blackburn works for a tow truck company. He was on the highway digging cars out of the snow. Even after they're going through and plowing, there's still a fine layer of ice and the drift is just going right over it and it's causing it to just get even slipperier. Rachel Schmidt was stuck in traffic and says it's a big inconvenience for her. She needs to get back to her college. Well, I have to write a paper today that I procrastinated a little bit, so I do need to get back to Kalamazoo soon. People we spoke to on the side of the highway say you got to drive slow and be safe in these conditions. Brian Wilk, Fox 47 News. The highways have been a mess all over mid-Michigan. The semi slid off I-96 near Okemos Road. The freeways had to be closed between there and US-127. No word on any injuries. I-96 has since reopened in both directions.